How y'all doing? How y'all doing? How y'all doing? <laughs> Thank you guys so much for joining Tiara's Tarot. I appreciate you guys clicking onto my video. This video will be for all my beautiful and my handsome kings and queens out there. How y'all doing? How y'all doing? Keep in mind that this is a gentle reading, so it's not going to resonate with everyone. So please take the parts that does resonate so it doesn't leave it on out. Also, this could be the, you know, uh, past, present, or in the future. And to be aware of any scammers in the comments that you pretended to be a girl, okay? Um, going back to that song about Pleasure P, Gotta Have You. Okay, I need you back in my life. Okay, something, something, something. Y'all, there, there is a situation here where somebody, I don't know, somebody is into the wildest things, Okay. Like, somebody really hits below the belt. Y'all wouldn't even... I don't know if this is past tense or this is what somebody intended to do towards you, Divine Feminine or Divine Masculine. Okay? But it's like somebody tried to orchestrate something behind the scenes. As y'all can see, the cards are on the table. I was supposed to do this reading yesterday. I had something to do. I had to go out with the boot. And so I'm getting back to it and I'm like, what the hell? So you guys, there's someone here that is upset about, because the, they're watching you. We already know that's the same shit, different day. Every, it's somebody always watching the divine feminine or divine masculine. But somebody has watched you enough to the point where it's like they're wanting to end something or betray you in some type of way because they do not want you to go into a contract. To fulfill a contract, either that's a promotion or a love contract. Okay? Some of y'all, y'all can be lonely. But just because you're alone doesn't mean you're lonely. Okay? If that makes sense. Somebody here is discussing some type of a plan. Y'all, I'm trying to put this in the lightest way that I can. But there is somebody that... Because they got some toxic secrets, baby. Oh, 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 oh. They got some toxic secrets. Okay? And somebody's dealing with a side chick. They could have met this person at work or something of that nature. There was some type of plan to get you out of the way. I'm getting somebody's plotting on your life, baby. But the plot is... Oh, my gosh, y'all. Look, look what we got here. Sex offender. Human trafficking. Somebody either hired a sex offender to come in and do something to you or somebody hired somebody to come in and traffic you. Somebody was trying to get you out of there, but it, I'm getting two people though. But the main, the head person is a female. It's a female. There's a female here that was trying to get you trafficked is what I'm getting here, y'all. And it's crazy because the more I analyzed and looked at these cards, y'all, this woman could look like you on the low. Okay, you could be a beautiful, uh, dark skin complexion. And you got this woman want her complexion to be just like yours. I'm getting that. I don't know if some of you rock your hair natural or something of that nature. This person tries to rock your hair natural. Okay, rock their hair natural. Okay, you could have curls. This person want to wear curls. Is what I'm getting here. And it's a secret between two people. So there was two people here that was plotting on you. Trying to either get you trafficked or either get you, you know, essayed. I'm going to say that, okay? That's what I'm getting here. Because there was a woman that was tired of being on the side. Sideline who? Okay? So whoever this woman is, that's a sideline ho. She mad. She want to be the main. Is what I'm getting. The main. Wow. She don't want to be the one to know me. She want to be the main. But she want to get you out of the way. Because she feels like you're the main feminine energy. But this is, the, this is the thing. You're not with this masculine that she's so, you know, stuck on. But the fact that you are still around. And you're still breathing. And you're still alive. She wants you gone. Because for some reason. You got somebody that's infatuated with you. A masculine energy. I'm so sick of this shit, y'all. Somebody wants you back in their life. 
They are watching you and they see how peaceful you are at this time. They see that your life is at peace. You're at peace right now. You're not mad, angry, upset. You're not even bitter. Okay, is what I'm getting here. And this is pissing them off to see you so happy. To see you at peace. So somebody keeps trying to plot on you. Is what I'm getting. There's a feminine that is okay with being a side bitch. Okay. She was okay with being a side bitch. And somebody can have like weird ass piercings. Ooh, Lord, if this is you, no judgment. <laughs> but I'm getting like whoever this, this other woman is, she can have a lot of piercings. Okay. She could definitely carry herself in that dark, darker image. Okay. Is what I'm getting here. Um, as in like goth or something. Something like that. Or you could be a goth. You could like black. I know I like black shit. You can't tell me shit about no black. Even in the summertime, I'm going to wear me some black. Okay. Um, and I'm just saying, I'm just trying to describe the situation or this person or what have you. Okay. But, um, yeah. So, I'm getting that she is going back to a masculine energy and saying like, yeah, I got this set up. I got this plotted. Da -da 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 -da. All we need to do is sit back and just, you know. See if this is going to play out on this divine feminine or divine masculine. Like I said, put it where it fits. Okay, type of energy that she on. Mm. But for real, for real, he trying to keep his hands clean. Whoever this masculine is that's behind this, trying to keep his hands clean is what I'm getting here. Okay, he's allowing her to go out there to pay for something or he giving her money like, yeah, go see if you can find a hitman or, oh, damn, I, I didn't mean to say a hitman. So somebody could have like, damn, somebody was thinking of every scenario. Okay, trying to get a sex offender to come towards you, maybe SAU. Also went to try to, you know, uh, find somebody in the elites because, uh, you know, let's keep it real. At least be doing all that shit. Trafficking kids and, 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 and women and shit like that. Either to feed a certain type of creature or to be youthful. If you know what I'm talking about. Are you understanding what I'm saying? But anyway, um, type of energy. Okay. So somebody got uh, in contact with somebody. Okay. That's in the elite, a higher power. Okay, how the hell, y'all, we, it's too many of us, it's nine billion of us, or however many people it is of us on the goddamn planet, why the hell is we allowing 13 royal, and I won't even say royal, okay, but uh, 13 families controlling us, we, what the fuck, how is we allowing them to do that, we gotta come together, y'all, cause times is getting crazy, people saying that they seen a motherfucking, uh, you know, Leviathan and stuff like that, you get what I'm saying? And there was two Leviathans. They said God destroyed the first one. Um, you know what I'm saying? In the beginning of time. And you know what I'm saying? They're saying that now this is year of the dragon. They found that dragon on top of the state empire. I, it came out, came on there out of nowhere. A prop. How the fuck that shit come, go, you know, get on there overnight? Come on now. They're trying to tell us something. This is the year of the dragon. These reptilians or Leviathan or whatever like that is all coming the fuck out. You understand what I'm saying? Ooh, I'm getting spooks. You get what I'm saying? It's, it, we got other shit to worry about, like humanity and hope. Okay, period. But we about to get sightings. We about to get all of that. But I'm going to get back to the program. But yeah, you know, we living in crazy times. You feel me? And it's like people won't believe that. Oh, my God, people be over here, you know, saying human trafficking. All oh, that's coming out too. Okay? You know what I'm saying about people trafficking people and kids. And that's exactly... What these motherfuckers are trying to do. Get in contact with somebody in higher authority. Okay? Dirty cop. Dirty something. In order to traffic it, you. Okay? Because you are a divine being. You are an empress or an emperor. Okay? That's what I'm getting. But their motive was she wanted you out of here. Out of the picture. She didn't even want you alive. He didn't want you uh, here because he didn't want you to move on. Get into a contract or whatever may be. Fulfill your destiny. Is what I'm getting here. Okay, wow. Mm-mm-mm. mm mm mm, -mm. mm, -mm, -mm. Time to let go. 
move the fuck on. Oh my gosh. Like this is talking to whoever this couple is. It's time for them to let go, let you go here and just move on with their lives because you are protected from any harm. Whoever you are, you are protected by the most high. How many times is God and your angels and your ancestors going to show these people how protected you are? How many times do they, do they have to show them? You hear what I'm saying? Mm -mm -mm. We're at a spiritual warfare at this time. And everybody's trying everything in their power either to survive, okay? Or, you know what I'm saying, wipe people out. You know what I'm saying, the evil version of it. Wipe people out in order to get ahead. Like, you know what I'm saying, these are the end times, y'all. Okay? For real, for real. But you, on the other hand, it's like you are minding your fucking business with self-care being here and intuition. Some of y'all, some people, whoever these people are, they don't want you to either, you know, um, be alone by yourself to your thoughts. Because they feel like once you go into like meditation or hermit mode or what have you, nobody can disturb your peace. It's like you just come out bigger and fucking better and you'll find, it, you'll find out who's doing what behind the scenes. You get what I'm saying? Somebody doesn't like your mind. Somebody does not like your ability. Somebody does not like the fact that you have direct contact with the source. Okay? Because somehow you always find out the scheme or the plot or the plan against you. Is what I'm getting here. Alright? Somehow you always find out. So you got here people afraid of the fact that you're going to expose them. Okay? That's why they watch you every day. Okay? Afraid of the fact that you're going to expose them. Is what I'm getting here. That's why they try so hard, okay, to watch you and monitor you is what I'm getting here because some of y'all are very intuitive, whoever I'm talking to. You are very intuitive, okay? And you be knowing what the fuck is up behind the scenes. And these people know that you know, but they're afraid of you exposing them. So it's like people taking shit. I'm getting whoever this couple is too. It's like they take shifts, okay, to monitor you and keep an eye on you. That is so fucking weird, Okay? But these people hoping you make a mistake, hoping you slip up, hoping you give some type of information about your whereabouts or your location. I'm getting here so they can, you know, so that's why, I, oh my gosh, I wonder, because I'm, I'm, I'm seeing, I'm hearing GPS, okay? So they can get you alone, okay, and scoop you up is what I'm getting here. Yeah. And some of you I'm hearing also, you need to watch your neighbor, okay? Because one of your neighbors could be registered sex offender, okay? I don't know if you have children, okay? Um, or you just have a neighbor that's watching you, okay? For some of y'all, all right? They find you to be very attractive and they could feel like, oh, since you live by yourself, you're an easier target. So just watch out for that as well, okay, boo? Yeah, we got here younger. You could be younger than somebody. Somebody could be younger than you. We got here playing innocent. Somebody feel like you're playing innocent here. Yeah, good girl. Oh, wow, but you're not. Okay? So people try to make you seem out to be a bad person so bad so that whatever narrative they try to throw at you, or gossip, okay, or evil, wicked, you know, saying whatever with the tongue, okay? It's like they want people to look at you in this light so it would be easier to feel like, or, you know, so they can release their guilty conscience of trying to harm you is what I'm getting here, okay? Y'all get what I'm saying? Like, what? But we got here too many chances, and we got here should have never played on your name. Wow. So these people should have never played on your name is what I'm getting here, okay? Because you are a chosen one. You are highly protected. That's what I'm getting. And they can't keep up these toxic secrets for long. Didn't I say they're afraid of you saying something? Okay. Yes, it's time to speak your mind. I don't know what you got, baby. Maybe you got a platform. Or maybe, like I said, something here. Okay. To the point where you got the authority or you're just in the willpower to speak up. And that's why, like I said, these people be going and shifting shit. Trying to see what you will expose. Okay. About them or what have you. Because you know something. All right.
Mm. So I'm getting there's people that's calling you crazy, delusional to everybody else. Oh, what she's saying is not real. Don't believe her. She's crazy. Um, she does not talk directly with her sources or guys or whatever she's claiming that she's talking to on the other side. She's really schizophrenic. She really has dark entities that's talking to her and all of that. They try to paint you out to be this person so bad. Okay. This so so because basically your word against theirs. You get what I'm saying? Okay. But it's like, if people, if you spoke up, some of you probably already did, okay? And that's why they're trying to say you're not, what you're saying is crazy, you're crazy, okay? Or whatever like that. That's why they're trying to say what you're saying is not true. <laughs> what? <laughs> wow, that shit is crazy. Anything to cover their, you know, saying they ass is what I'm getting here. But if you over here trying to sex offend somebody or think them in some type of way, baby, you the straight devil, honey. Okay, what? How are you okay with that? How can you wake up every day? Who even takes their time out to go out and look for someone? You know what I'm saying? In order to um, go through with this plan. Like, hey, do you know somebody that's sex traffic? Or, you know what I'm saying? Like, who does that shit? You feel me? Like, what? Oh, wow. We got here, make better fucking choices. Exactly. If you're pissed at where you are, then stop taking yourself there exactly if these people are upset about where they are in life okay they need to look in the mirror and they move accordingly like the fuck trying to take somebody else down just because you're jealous yeah we got here third party situation <sighs> so i guess this third party and this this ex here didn't want me to expose the fact that they was trying to human traffic you Okay, it's what I'm getting here. Yeah. Yeah, it says you look like a shit show. So they over here looking like a shit show. A hot fucking mess. Clean yourselves up, Buki. Y'all look pitiful out here in these streets. Okay? It's what I'm getting here. These people out here looking real pitiful. Trying to come for you. It's what I'm getting here, period. All right? And that's the thing about it. Because if you are single and you are by yourself, baby, it's like, you know, you'd rather be by yourself. Period. Point blank. Why would you want to be around people, you know, saying all the time and mixing up different energies and, you know, what have you, boo-boo, okay? Mm -hmm. It's better to stay to yourself. And, you know, women, some women be stereotyping other women when they say, oh, the woman that ain't got no friends, she the one you need to watch out for. No, the woman that don't have any friends is somebody that is very secure within herself, okay? Pure point blank. She don't need to have a bunch of friends in order to feel validated. Then most of them fucking friends, two, you know, saying three out of five out of them friends don't really give a fuck about her. No way. They're haters. You feel me? So nah, somebody that's by themselves that don't have a lot of friends is somebody that's content and very secured within herself, period. But you got a the Lulu motherfucking couple here that is into some wild ass shit, okay, that was trying to come for a divine feminine or divine masculine is what I'm getting here, okay? Oh, Lord, have mercy. Mm -mm -mm. So this is what they don't want to get out. What's sex trafficking and human trafficking spirit? We got her support at the bottom of the deck. So for some of y'all, if you are in a marriage, because we do have your happily married, and then we have here, I'm praying for us, I'm praying for you. Okay, so if you guys are in a happy marriage or what have you, like I said, there's somebody here that keeps trying to send distractions you guys' way. Okay, when it comes to you, both of y'all supporting each other. Okay, is what I'm getting here. Yeah, somebody trying to create, like I said, somebody doesn't want you to go into some type of a contract or some type of promotion. They don't want you to have it, okay? It's like every time I see you happy or every time I see you smiling, it's like, okay, let me go and attack that divine feminine or that divine masculine. Like, you got people that's very freaking bitter. Yeah, you got a man that's out here mad as fuck because they wanted you to earn their love and you ain't chasing after no man, okay? It's what I'm getting here. Yeah, we got here paying for the affections of a man. And I'm guessing whoever the side chick is, she's the one that's actually paying for the affection of this man. That's why she is going, you know, over and beyond to try to find whoever these people are that can do this to you. Okay? All right. And she's coming back and she's telling him what she found out. Woo -da -woo -da -woo, okay? So she's trying to earn this master love. Okay? You, on the other hand, you don't chase niggas like this. Okay? Period. Yes, it's walking away. Was the hardest thing I ever had to do for me, period. 
Okay, you had to walk away from this person like, ugh. They was, yeah. I, some of y'all, you might not even know what was going on. But you felt it in your soul and your spirit. And your guys was just, you know what I'm saying, telling you. And, you know, nudging you to get away from this person. That's what you did. And you started living your best fucking life, okay? Yeah, you started glowing. Your money started getting better, baby. Everything. Some of y'all... You couldn't be feeling paranoid, okay? You look at, I'm seeing this woman, she looking inside the blinds, especially at night, okay? Like there could be somebody here that was in a driveway. Maybe somebody used your driveway to back up and then, you know, turn the opposite way or something like that, you know? But then it's got you looking outside, trying to figure out, is you, you know, saying you protected or somebody playing with you, okay, whatever like that. But you are protected, baby. So don't be in no type of anxiety, honey, period. Yeah. But then we got here, let's create. See, you are dealing with somebody else. Else. Some of y'all could be dealing with somebody else here that you're creating a new family with. Okay, is what I'm getting here. Some of y'all could even be pregnant, all right? Or you just started a new family, okay? And these people here, this this past person is so completely jealous. Like they're so jealous, okay? Oh yeah, memories. Okay, for some of y'all, this person is extremely jealous if you already have a child or a child on the way with this new person. Like somebody here is just uh they have so much envy and resentment, okay? Built up anger towards you is what I'm getting here. And this person is somebody here that did you dirty. They're mad because you simply just decided to love yourself and walk away, okay? They can't believe you got away is what I'm getting here. Like, so somebody is definitely trying to get you out of here or was trying to get you out of here. But once again, you are protected from any harm, okay? Is what I'm getting here. Somebody could even be getting locked up, okay? Because maybe you're not the first one they did this to, all right? Because somebody is very clever, very manipulative, okay? They know how to get people to do what they want, get people to do favors for them, is what I'm getting here. Whoever this ex person is, like I said, this could be an ex or this could simply be a like a couple or whatever. Somebody just, tar you know, looked you up one day, thought you was an easy target or something like that. Others of y'all, this is a bitter ex, okay? Yeah, but maybe this person even was a sex worker. I'm getting for some of y'all. I don't know why I just heard gay for pay. So, ooh, that's not for everybody. That's not for everybody, okay? But somebody could have definitely was like that desperate at one point to the point where they was gay for pay, okay? Whoever this ex-man is. Mm. But yeah, this, this person know how to disguise themselves as whatever you want them to be whatever that you know what i'm saying type of energy okay oh lord mm. but now you got somebody here that wants to crown you that wants to you know invest in you and create with you here okay and somebody feel like they need to be a hindrance mm -hmm. in your life and stop this shit from happening okay but somebody might definitely get locked the fuck up okay Whoever, who's this ex person and this Jezebel energy that is trying to do this to my divine feminine or my divine masculine? Wow. What I tell you, you're going to get a victory over whatever the spiritual war is. Okay. Or these people having an issue with you and moving on. Okay. Yeah, you're definitely going to get a victory. Clarity is coming. The truth is coming. Yeah, somebody was definitely trying to, you know, fight with you over something. Okay? Like, they had a right to fight with you over something. But you're going to get, with the Six of Swords, you're going to get a positive outcome. Some of y'all, I'm seeing children. Some of y'all could have took y'all kids and left. Okay? Yeah. And learned a lesson from whatever this is, the situation. Okay, so I'm hearing some of y'all got out right on time. Okay, because if you did not get out of whatever situation this is, you might have also been, you know, saying traffic or whatever like that. Because for some of y'all, somebody's with somebody here that they cheated on you with in the past. They could have even met this person at their job is what I'm getting here. Okay. Yeah. You know, this I'm, I'm hearing also, this could even be a chick here that watch you and this person build something together in the past and wanted that for themselves this is a strategic sideline hoe okay the women the women that watch and you know what I'm saying be this these this is the type of woman that will befriend the divine feminine just so they can get close to their man okay is what I'm getting here 
Wow. I don't know what it is in these Jezebel mind to think just because you had a man that the divine feminine doesn't make you a divine feminine boogie. Sorry. That is the lowest of the low and it's quite ratchet and ghetto. Okay. That's the lowest of the low thinking, honey. Okay. Because that man is not going to treat you. Okay. The same way. But I would say, yeah, dogging them out. Yeah. Okay. But some of y'all I'm getting like, for example, you dealt with you, your ex is uh, putting his hands on the, the, the other chick, the, you know, the chick he with or whatever, the side chick. He could have been putting his hands on her ass, right? But he never put his hands on you. For example, okay, he respected you more than he respected this, this side chick, this sideline hoe. Okay, is what I'm getting here. Mm. Yeah, but we got here judgment. Yeah, these people are about to go through a period of judgment because these people misjudged you. Okay, like I said, they wanted to make it seem like you were such a bad person. You were so evil. You were this and you were that. But really, it was just coming from India's eyes. Okay, they were just jealous of you. This man and this woman. Okay? Yeah, so they're going through a period of judgment. Yeah, four cups. Yeah. And the tower. Yup. Okay? And we have your star, Aquarius Energy. Yup. So, these people I go through some type of a tire moment is what I'm getting here. So, they need to leave, leave the pettiness alone. Yeah, Eight of Cups. Spirit is telling this person to walk away. Okay? Walk away. Humbly walk away. Okay? Before shit gets straight. Like, I'm getting... Something is going to happen out of the blue. Okay? To these people or this person. Ooh, hair fine. Somebody might even have to go to court is what I'm getting. Okay, or like I said, they're going to judge themselves by the most high. Okay, is what I'm getting here. Yeah, I know y'all been seeing them images in the, in the sky. Okay, of a face. Okay, especially with that man over the moon. Okay, the face over the moon, behind the moon or whatever like that. And then like different shapes within the clouds and stuff. Ooh, child. Y'all been, they've been watching. They've been watching. Okay. And everybody has their own specific assignment. So it's like, you've been being watched as well, baby. Straight up. Okay. Yeah, somebody just simply mad because you have found yourself. You know who you are, okay? Somebody else got to do malicious shit in order to make it in life, okay? Is what I'm getting. Yeah, five of cups. Yeah, somebody, mm, they're going to be brought to their damn knees very fucking soon. You have eight of swords. Somebody going to jail. I'm mean, here. somebody say, get down, put your hands behind your back, okay? Period is what I'm getting. Because the reason why they're going to get caught because somebody paid somebody. I'm telling you, somebody paid somebody. Somebody went to somebody, went asking around who they could, uh, you know what I'm saying, who could do the job for them to traffic this divine feminine or what have you, okay? And that got back to an official is what I'm getting here, okay? Wow. Wow. And she got caught and also he got caught, okay? Because she was, oh, this is crazy, y'all. Yeah, all because somebody was jealous of the fact that you had other options, divine options. Yeah, we got the King of Swords, okay? Mm. Had other better suitors and options than this masculine, okay? Yeah, four cups. I mean, excuse me, four coins. Yeah, somebody here was very selfish. Somebody here was like, you don't give a fuck if you're with somebody or you by yourself. They wanted your energy all to themselves is what I'm getting. Somebody knows that you have divine energy. You carry divine energy, okay? But I ain't, this is crazy, y'all. Some, you know... A man be so jealous and envious of a woman, okay, and hate on a woman. I'll be. This is a true narcissist, you guys. Like, this is the worst case scenario of a narcissist. You have like, you know, what I'm saying that stage one narcissist. You know, what I'm saying where they manipulative. You know, what I'm saying to get, you know, trying to get something that way. But this person here, it's like they rather win at all costs. Okay, they're gonna get other people involved on this scheme as well. Okay, this Aquarius Gemini Libra, they're gonna get other people involved, and, and it's it's gonna sound clever because this person knows how to manipulate. Okay, they know how to do that. Whoever this individual is, you can know how this person is. Okay, but by, behind the veil that they try to present to other people, you know how they are. Okay, that's why you got the fuck out of Dodge now. They're going to be exposed. Somebody's going to be exposed. Okay, period. I can't make it up. The chariot. So with the chariot, to me, that's like an official here. Yeah, nine of coins. I can't make it up. Okay, the nine of swords. Wow. This is an official. This person might even get crazy, like might even try to attack this official. Wow. I'm getting either there's a police officer pulling up or um, they're coming to their door or something like that. <clears throat> and it's like they handed this person some type of a document or something of this name, you know, something like that. 
and somebody here gonna wanna uh, get crazy, they're gonna try to confront this goddamn official because somebody just feels like, damn, I can't get caught. Like somebody really thought that they was not gonna get caught, baby. Okay, they really thought that they was the Shiites. Okay, is what I'm getting here. They thought that they was untouchable. Is what I'm getting here. Somebody really thought that it was untouchable. So somebody might have a manic episode after whatever these documents or whatever this is is about to be handed to them. Is what I'm getting here. With the nine of swords, they might act the fool, and this official is going to lock them down, put them down. Okay, is what I'm getting here. Yeah, we got here the strength, the sun, okay, hermit, Virgo energy. So some of y'all, it's like you're about to have a better day, honey. You are all you already are above your enemies. Period point blank. You're still about to step into this childlike energy, is what I'm getting here. Yeah, and be very fucking happy. Is what I'm getting, like pure point blank. Okay. They they about to meet their day. Okay, meet their maker is what I'm hearing. Somebody about to get caught for trying to do this shit to, towards you is what I'm getting straight up. They about to get caught because like what? Mm -mm -mm. See, that's why God keep allowing certain people to do what they do behind the scenes. Okay, so they when they when it hit them, it hit them hard. You feel what I'm saying? Okay, hit them, hit them, hit them, hit them, hit them, hit them. <laughs> Type of energy, you feel me? Is what I'm getting here. Wow. And it's going to allow you to create with someone. Think some of y'all are going to definitely be feeling like something is just different in the air. Okay. And that's these blessings coming into your life. And that's God handling the shit behind the scenes straight up. Okay, period. All right. I think I'm going to end it right there, though. Let me see. We got here prayers dope as fuck. I know that's right. Some of y'all been praying. Okay. Y'all been praying for jurisdiction. You know what I'm saying? I can't even say right. <laughs> but justice here. Y'all been praying for justice, baby. And it's on its way. They heard your prayers. And they handling this shit behind the scenes straight up. Okay. Or some of y'all need to spend some time asking God in the universe for what you want. Okay. Even if you're speaking it to the void, okay? At the very least, you'll hear your own wish list and get a better idea of what you really do want. You might even figure out what's the first baby step to getting it. At the very best, there's a strong ass genie in the sky who's magically ready to grant your wishes, baby. I know that's right. And I'm going to end it right there. I love you guys. I'll see you guys in the next one. If y'all want to watch any more of my content, go check out my TikTok account. Love you guys. Bye.